are at the world famous Christie's Pizza. This is the most famous pizza on the beach. I don't know what it is about it. It's delicious, and whenever I get home, I gotta run right to Christie's for a box of eight. So we're gonna grab some pizza. It's a little different than a lot of the pizza you're used to, but I'm telling you, it's delicious. Oh, there it is. Look at that. Fresh out of the oven. Thank you very much. No lines, no waiting now, too. You come down here about 12, 12.30 when the bar's close. Line down to the ocean. I'm gonna go enjoy that. Look at that. Tomato cookie. Hampton Beach delicacy right there. Where are you guys from? I'm from Cape Cod. From Cape Cod. <laughs> so I, you come from Cape Cod yeah. to get seafood Up here. on Hampton Beach. <laughs> yes, I if do. that's not a ringing endorsement, <laughs> I don't know what is. Yeah. South Beach seafood comes highly approved. So this is the famous Sea Catch restaurant on Hampton Beach. This was also my very first job as a kid. I think I was about 13 years old and I used to scrub dishes up in that kitchen and they just kept coming and coming because the food was so good. And every day I said, this is the last day I ever do this. And then on my way out, the cute waitresses from UNH had pinched my cheek and go, we'll see you tomorrow. And I was back the next day. How's the seafood, fellas? It's awesome. Yeah? yeah it's what, good. People come from all over New England to get this seafood right here yeah. at the Sea Catch. That's another hot spot. Yeah? What'd you have? Uh, chicken fingers and french fries. Chicken fingers. That's good seafood yep. right there. Yep. The nice chicken fingers. We found a foodie. We've got a plate of chicken fingers. This is the Hampton Beach Casino Ballroom, one of the coolest venues on the East Coast. When I was a kid, I used to sit on these stairs and I'd listen to the Ramones and I'd listen to Huey Lewis and B-52s and I'd listen to George Carlin telling jokes because I couldn't get in because I was too young. And then 15 years later, I actually performed up there and it was pretty cool. How long have you been working here? Third year. Third year? Yeah. You like it? When I, was, when I was your age, I used to work here, and I ran the horse race, and I used to do the commentator. Here comes number seven on the outside. That was my main job. You did it too? Yeah. Fantastic. Let me tell you where you're headed, my friend. You're going to be rudderless for a little while, and then you're going to eventually find your way into stand-up comedy. On a sitcom, they cancel it, and you're right back to telling jokes in the Elks Club. That's your future. It's in the hole. I'm looking at the prices over there. Those are the 1980s prices, right? How long you been here? 28 years. 28 years you've been making fried dough. Uh, that and many other things. <laughs> you know, I used to work across the way. I used never to work in your life. I... <laughs> this guy knows me well. If you hit me with that, I'm gonna deck you. And I, and I used to be a boxer, so don't think I can't. I'm not. I'm not. I think you could. But I'll tell you what, I don't know a lot of boxers that have been eating fried dough for 30 years, still going to knock a guy out. I don't eat it. So you'll sell it, but you won't eat it. I won't eat it. Right. It's no good for you. It's no good for you. You heard it from the guy who sells it. It's no good for you, fried dough. I've been telling people that for 28 years. They are delicious. Those are really good. Now. If a guy my size wanted big donuts, do you have those available? We got buckets. We have buckets. Yeah, for the bigger ones, we want a lot of donuts. So I look like the kind of guy that wants a bucket of donuts. They got me pegged. <laughs> and if you don't feel like eating the food, you can just have your name painted on it. You eating anything today? We're, we're, we're pouring um, all the food. We, we, were, we were going to get the uh, fried dough. Yeah. And the ice cream cones. Yeah. Um, I'm with and a slice of, uh, and a slice of Christie's, and that's the Hampton Beach hat trick right there. What's up, buddy? I got a little room left for some fried dough. I'm gonna go just old school cinnamon sugar, please. All right. Do you want powdered sugar or regular sugar? Uh. Powdered, please. Yeah, you gotta, you gotta get powdered sugar. Uh, 425, please. 
Best money I spent all day right here. Thank you, buddy. I appreciate day. it. Thank you, guys. Get that tip jar out on the counter. You'll make more dough. Pun intended. Well, that's a wrap on Jimmy Eats Hampton Beach. I've eaten all the food I can on this strip. I got a little room left for dessert. If you want to see me eat more stuff, follow me on Instagram. And if you want to game Asteroids, I'll see you at Playland.